Hello everyone, today we're gonna show you how to find a waterline in a boat. We're gonna use SketchUp 2018 with two plugins, Fredo Tools and the second is MS Physics. So further now we need to find which is the volume of this hole and we go to Fredo Tools, go to solid volume and we need to wait now till two solid volume calculated almost two minutes so now that is complete and let's keep this value yeah. One more peak. and let's go back to no. after that we need to go to extension ls physics create buoyancy plate now we have two options first of all we need to map we need to draw a line here and the second line is not the ball so Okay, now let's go to pro properties of this one. Those two options which I said before, we need to calculate by density here and by mass. So first of all, we go by density. And I choose density of uh, salt water. So let's take a look. density of if that is the water by density so the second we need to try by mass that's this thing that must be around 1500 kilogram this hole so let's play to see is that sufficient or not. So that is the problem of the ball. For by mass for 1500 kilogram. So let's go to. Let's go. those value per mass depend how thick must be your bolt, your hull. Because the mass now we know that we use for example let's do that for example how long is it? Almost not meters, not put two meters. So one more time. Let's think this boat must be five hundred six five thousand six hundred fifteen kilograms. That is the water line which we're looking for for our boat. This hole. I did only for I did only for demonstration because a lot of people which are small boat builder or wooden boat builder and that. 
to them because it was helpful for me. Why? Because it's too helpful. I did one, one uh, design for about 500. So five, five point five meters, two by two meters, and one by six meters, and uh, that was helpful to me. And I wish it helpful to and to all of you. See you next time.